Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Razix back with another video and in today's video we will be discussing which is more important the latency or speed and RAM and why. But before we get into that, if you are new, make sure to subscribe to the channel since at 1k we are doing a giveaway and face reveal and make sure to share this channel with your friends and family. But anyways, let's get right into the video. So, to make it clear, I am not sponsored by any company, this is just facts that I have found when researching this topic. I will put a video on screen right now of a 1080 Ti using DDR2, DDR3, and DDR4 memory to show the benchmark on the FPS difference when using lower latency and lower speed RAM, which is a DDR2, to using higher latency but also higher speed RAM, DDR4. As you guys can see, there is virtually no frame difference showing that we are kind of being scammed since the same DDR2 technology since around 2006, more than a decade ago, performs almost similar to DDR4, which is like scary. On to my next point. As you guys can see, the chart I will put up on the screen compares the latency of different RAM technologies, ranging from the first ever you know ram ever invented to what is being used right now in ddr4 at 2666 megahertz which is the fastest you can kind of get out of box i want you guys to pay attention to the ddr3 clocked at 1333 megahertz which is slower than the ddr4 clocked at 2666 megahertz if you notice they have the same true latency and the ddr4 does run at half of the clock cycle so you must think to yourself Dang, the DDR4 just blows out the DDR3, you know, out of the water, but that's just not the case. If you notice the CAS latency, you guys that DDR4 has double the latency as the DDR3, making it truly all not that faster. You know, as you guys saw in the video, the DDR4, DDR3, and DDR2 were all running around the same. But anyway, guys, even though DDR5 already does exist, and has been shown off it's kind of still in development they're holding it off also kind of to make a little bit more money off ddr4 and we can see that some gpus are already using ddr6 so you guys are like wait where's ddr5 if gpus already using ddr6 you know also this is without talking about a very underappreciated pc part the hard drive even if you have the best cpu and the best gpu if you have a garbage hard drive running at 5400 rpm like, it's just not going to run good. But that's another topic for another video. Well, guys, that wraps up the video for today. Hopefully you enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like, comment, share this channel with your friends and family, and remember to subscribe since at 1K we are doing a giveaway and a face reveal. So, hey, guys, see you in the next video. Peace.